She is a member of the varsity cheerleading squad and is the senior class president. Kayla is attending The Ohio State University, majoring in biomedical science with the goal of becoming an orthodontist. Kayla states that she is grateful for the diversity of programs at VHS because it has provided her the opportunity to build lasting friendships with many different classmates. Kayla wants to thank her parents, Janet and Gary Cameron, for all of their love and encouragement, and to the staff of Brunswick High School for helping her over the years to grow into the proud student that she is and the person that she is today. Ladies and gentlemen, Ms. Kayla Cameron. Good afternoon. My name is Kayla Cameron. On behalf of the fellow graduates and myself, I would like to welcome the families and friends that have gathered here today. I would also like to send out my greatest appreciation to all of the members of the Brunswick City School District. Teachers, principals, counselors, support staff, and all other individuals central in making Brunswick High School the great educational institution it is. Without the support of the people around us, no matter what situation, parents, grandparents, siblings, or any of the above, we as students would not be where we are sitting today, right in this very moment, if it wasn't for you. So I'm pleased to say thank you. Neil Gaiman once said, now go and make interesting mistakes. Make amazing mistakes. Make glorious and fantastic mistakes. Break rules. Leave the world more interesting for your being here. Make good art. This quote is expressed within each and every graduate sitting here before me today. As I stand in front of you all, I have realized that it is nearly impossible to come up with the words to reveal the significance of what the last 13 years, 156 months, 4,750 days, 114,000 hours and 6,840,000 minutes of our lives have consisted of. One thing I have come to terms with is that senior year, the last 180 days, were truly unlike any other year. This was the year that we as students, as graduates, began writing the stories that will create the cover page to the rest of our lives. In the past four years, there have been lasting moments and memories that piece together each of our stories. Walking into the West Entrance for the first time as high school students, I'm sure if we all closed our eyes right now, took a deep breath, and went back to that day, no matter what, you would still feel that pit of nerves in the bottom of your stomach. Then, fast forward to what feels like the next day, walking into Brunswick High School, officially a senior knowing that these are the same hallways that you have traveled on for the last three years, but something is different this time. This will be the last, first time you will ever attend Brunswick High School. This is when you know the paintings, the drawings, and the sculpting of our lives begin. There have been many sayings that we encounter throughout our senior year that we've all been told numerous times. Make the memories count, it will be over before you know it, and these are the best days of your lives. We have all heard it a thousand times, but these words hold true. They are more than just sayings. These moments that we build, the art that we have created, all becomes a blur as we stand here today in this moment, thinking to ourselves that this is our graduation. Where did all of the 13 years, 156 months, 4,750 days, 114,000 hours, and 6,840,000 minutes go. To those who join their graduates today, we hear your sayings. We don't realize that all this time is going by because we are the ones personally living the memories. Yes, we think to ourselves that this is the last time we will be playing our favorite sports, taking our last steps onto the field or stage, putting on your uniform for one last time, going to the last meeting for your favorite clubs, performing for your final concert, or getting ready for our last school dance. But when we think about all of those last times and last moments, 
we remember how rich and fulfilling they were to our paintings, drawings, and sculptures. We might not have known it, but the experience and advice given created the palettes and colors. Now it's our time to become the artists. As we continue this path, whether going off to a university, enlisting to serve our country, or going into the work field, we are all leaving here today knowing that there is a new chapter ahead. So as Neil Gaiman would say, this is the time for us to go and make all of our mistakes. This is the time for us to go out and meet new people and create new relationships that will carry on with us throughout the rest of our lives. This is the time to break the rules and learn from our mistakes to make our futures as strong and bright as we can. We have the whole world in our graduation caps and we cannot forget that the only struggle that can hold us back from anything is the one that we hold within ourselves. So my advice to all of you on this exceptional day is to go and be you. Do the things that make you happy and success will follow. You are in control of your story, of your own art. So make it as beautiful and as colorful as you desire because creating art is a one-of-a-kind act, just as we are all one-of-a-kind. Thank you.